Hey guys, take a moment to video if you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to disable your iPhone from changing wallpaper when it's on the lock screen. So, one of the features starting with iOS 16 was that if you press and hold about two seconds on your lock screen, it asks you to change or customize the wallpaper, but it could be quite annoying and you might not want to do that. So, we're going to show you how you can disable it. So, let's get started. So, one thing about this wallpaper feature, which was introduced on iOS 16, now even on iOS 17, is that you go to a wallpaper, right? You can add a new wallpaper. And as you can see here, Apple states that, you know, you can change, add, edit from the lock screen, but there is no actual toggle or button to turn that off or disable it. So what you'll have to do is a couple of these other settings that need to be tweaked to in order to prevent or slow down kind of the lock screen when you're on the lock screen from it entering that edit mode and these help in terms of reducing accidentally tapping it or holding the tap so what do you do which in a way disables it the first thing is in your settings here you're going to go to display and brightness and under display and brightness you're going to turn off raise to wake so that's the first feature you're going to turn off so by default it's turned on but turn it off next feature you're going to do in your settings is under the accessibility here you can go to touch and then under touch here where it says tap or swipe to wake you're going to turn that off so that when you tap or uh, swipe it doesn't go into the edit mode for the wallpaper and then lastly in the touch as well here now this is optional you if you don't want to change this you don't have to but the other two you want to change is your haptic touch speed so if you do a haptic touch or you know the septic touch that you have by default it kind of tells you what speed that it will activate that so what you can do is slow down that so when you slow down that so even though you press and hold the touch screen on the whole screen it's going to take a little bit longer which will prevent you from accidentally getting into that mode now again this is optional you can keep it as default but i usually think slower helps even reduce it or completely disable that getting into the into that edit mode for your wallpaper which essentially will disable it so it's up to you play around with it if you want to keep it slow but when you do slow that means when you press something it's going to take a little bit longer but again will help when it comes to pressing and holding because it's only two seconds it will delay that a little bit longer so it doesn't just accidentally enter as you can see here it takes much longer now when i press see as you can see here when i press it, it doesn't automatically get into that edit screen when it's like that so go ahead and play around with it i hope this video was helpful and we're going to tell you guys if there is an update in the future when apple does introduce that but at this time there is no one single setting besides the settings that we showed you on how to disable it so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and for future tips and tricks on your apple devices make sure that like and subscribe button thanks for watching guys see you guys next time